Okay, let us bask in the ambience that is this parting space. You hear me? I don't. Give me the scout. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kyra Sean. So today's video is brought to you by Hair Vivi, and let me just tell you, they have came through with the new, new once again. Today's install will feature their brand new zero adhesive wig. When I say zero adhesive, I mean no gel, no glue, no nothing on this joint to make her sit on my head like this. So if you wanna see and hear what this new concept is all about, make sure you stay tuned for that. If you're new to the channel, make sure you go ahead and subscribe and smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this in the future. Let's go.
keep it up now. Okay, so like I said, this unit comes to us from Hair Vivi. It is their brand new Abby Yaki HD Lace Bob wig. It comes in a 13 by six lace frontal or a five by five lace closure. You can also choose your cap size, so a small or a medium. I'm pretty sure the medium is like a 22 and a half. I am wearing the 22 and a half and it's actually fitting pretty big on me. This unit also comes with a fake scalp in the color cappuccino, mocha, or honey. And it also has the piano keys elastic band with inside the cap so that you're able to adjust your elastic band around your ears where you want it to sit. Because sometimes that wig band be sitting right here on your ears and your ears be cocked up to the side. We, we don't like all that. This unit also comes in two different looks. So if you want them to curl your unit for you, you can definitely choose that option at checkout. Now all the specs that I got is listed down below in the description box. So if you want to check that out, you definitely can. Let's go ahead and get into what's new. Okay, what's the T hair VV? Okay, bars. <laughs> So Hair VV is hitting us with the zero adhesive V ear shape tapered wig. Now they've added the V shape ear tapes around the ear so that you can bend the lace towards your face. So if you watch the put down, you saw the inside of the cap. However, I'm gonna show it on the screen again so you can see it one more time. You'll see it sometimes with synthetic wigs where the, you know, the ear tapes or the ear tabs around the ears um, or for the sideburns will kind of bend into like, you know, the side of your head so you can kind of alleviate the gap that you may have between your face and the lace. That is what they now have put on their wigs to help you get this down close as it can get to your face so that when you're pulling this cap on with the elastic band, the adjustable straps, it is not going to leave as big of a gap on the side. And I say as big of a gap because I do still have a little bit of gapage because obviously, you know, that's how it's sitting on me, but also because I did not use the comb that's in this unit. If you use the combs that come here on the side or in the middle, you can definitely pop them joints under your wig cap and then then put it on and then bend the tape, which will alleviate most of that space. Because y'all know I don't use the combs, okay? No, I just put this joint on over my wig cap and let her go. Because those bendable ear tabs are there, if they don't fit around your ears perfectly, you will have to go in and cut around them, which will then leave some excess like I have on mine. So I may have been able to use a smaller cap, but I didn't want to chance it. So if possibly, Hair Viva, you could change the sizing up a little bit to like a small, medium, large, especially with this V shape, if you want this to be glueless, we our sideburns not gonna come all the way down to our chin. Okay, I need my sideburns to be up here by my ear where they're supposed to be at. Now they did send me this little clear joint that I've been seeing everybody rock, and I was so excited about this. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna give her a go for my big old dome. No, okay, just no. It's too tight. Okay, it was squeezing and squeezing and squeezing my dad on temples, and I could I couldn't do it. So I had to go back in with my tried and true little velvet joint, and that that's why I'm a stick. Okay, I'm, I'm happy over there. <laughs> It also has these little Velcro, not, not even Velcro, they're like uh, three felt pieces in the back around the nape area so that you have a comfortable fit next to your nape. Because you know, sometimes the comb and you know, the uh, the back of the wig be snagging on your nape. You know, that kitchen, the kitchen be popping. Like, yeah, mm, we don't like that, okay? So, it's a fly in here. <laughs> like, it's real disrespectful up in here. Like, sir, excuse me, do you, do you need time, huh? Now the hairline already comes pre-plucked, the knots are bleached, everything is sitting real pretty. This unit is ready to go out the pack as far as the whole construction of the cap. You will need to go in and you know, flat iron the unit, curl the unit, whatever you wanna do, because you know, obviously the style is not gonna last in the pack. There were some little straggly hairs kinda flying around my face, but that's normally how it is with Hair VV anyway. They don't really give you baby hairs, it's just kinda like really sparsely plucked around there, so you know, you just have a lot of flyaways. So you wanna go in with your products to kinda smooth them back, pluck them out, do what you gotta do. I did cut mine a little bit short over here to kind of give me some like you know wispy things going to the side here because I decided to rock her in the side part however she's good in the middle if you want to rock her in the middle okay the parting space on this joint is ample you hear me when I parted this joint I was like oh she just going and going ain't she yeah now the only con that I do have for this unit is the fake scalp because the unit is already bleached I'm not really I'm not really a fan of the fake scalp. They can just take it out as far as I'm concerned because they leave a line of demarcation. Like it never blends in well. You can always see it right up in, you see it? You see it right there? It doesn't fit for me. So, Hair Vivi, you can just go ahead and don't even give it to me. I don't, I don't need it. I've tried a lot of units from Hair VV and all of them came with a fake scalp except for my full lace unit. It was supposed to come with a fake scalp, but it didn't. It blended into my hairline and my scalp Perfectly, Y'all do all the work for the bleaching of the knots around here, and then you put the scalp in it, it's kinda just like, why? Like, I wanna see the bleached knots. All that work you spent, and then you gonna cover it up? No, no, let us see that joint, okay? Let us bask in the ambience that is this parting space. You hear me? I don't, 
Give me the scalp. Okay, but outside of that, she's a gorgeous unit. The texture is really nice. It's a yakky texture. It feels good, okay? It swings just as nice. I didn't wash the condition the hair. This is how it came. I just pressed her on through. She smells great. This is what you pay for. Hold on, my baby hair is not swooping. It's not swooping. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Now, before you ask, this unit is expensive, okay? If you're new to my channel, Hair VV does run up there with the big dogs, okay? Stomping with the big dogs, you hear me? If you're not new to my channel, then you already know what it is. They hit in the pocket. They... They up in there, but the texture of this joint, worth it. The hairline of this joint, worth it. The gluelessness of this joint, is that a word? Worth it, okay? Everything on this unit is worth it to me. But that is all I got for you guys today. Shout out one more time to Hair VV for sending me this unit. I really appreciate it. Again, I will put my direct link and my specs down below so you guys wanna check this unit out, you can. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Also, smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much, and I will see you next time. Bye.